measurement of angle of progression AOP by intrapartum transperineal ultrasonography in second stage of labor provides a reproducible objective tool to evaluate labor progression by visualizing fetal head station and descent supplementing clinical examination. It assists in detecting issues such as asynchronism and abnormal descent, improving decision making about interventions and mode of delivery. The technique is as follows. The ultrasound probe is placed sagittally on the maternal perineum to obtain the angle. Angle of progression is the angle measured between a line from the inferior margin of the pubic symphysis to the leading head edge on a transperineal ultrasound image. Now automated software is available eliminating the need for manual estimation. As shown in this diagram, automated technique depicts the echogenic center of the pubic symphysis line X whereas the manual method includes the whole length of the pubic symphysis line X plus line Y. In that case, angle 1 formed by the automated technique will be invariably greater than the angle 2 which is the one measured by manual technique. There is one drawback of automated measurement. Here is an example of a case of automated AOP measurement in which the fetal skull line passes through a large fetal caput significantly overestimating the angle of progression. This can be avoided by manual measurement avoiding caput. Angle of progression cutoff values have been established to guide delivery mode prediction. A cutoff around 123 to 125 strongly predicts successful vaginal delivery. Larger angle of progression values correlate with greater fetal descent. For example, AOP values above 125 are associated with higher chances of spontaneous vaginal delivery, while values above 145 degrees support successful vacuum extraction. Here is a chart illustrating the correlation between angle of progression ranges and the likelihood of vaginal delivery. It shows how increasing AOP angles measured on transperineal ultrasound correspond to a higher probability of successful vaginal delivery with angles greater than 140 degrees associated with a 99% likelihood of spontaneous vaginal delivery.